but I'm doing fine. I don't know if I'll have enough slots. Looks like I will. Um, I'm sorting furnishings for a reason. I have uh, I have a plan. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, today I want to talk about contests right up front, and then we can talk about other things. Okay, so January fourteenth, ESO Housing Network. I don't know who's going to review those when they're done. I, I don't know if I'm going to review them, if they're going to have a twitch of it, or if they're just going to post them or what. But uh, January 14th, ESO Housing Network. Hello, stalker. You're fine. Um, I did that contest. That was my Lou Monstery guy. So if you want to do that, you should really consider it. Uh, there's more information below at the Discord link. Um, the January 25th potato house is also complete. You guys helped me with a, um, Mr. Potato Head. That one is currently living at my hundings. That is a J Hart quests and all J Hart, I mean, J Hart, uh, contest, you know, all of J Hart's contests can be found on the housing forums, which you should be probably checking anyway. But here is a link to it. Boop! And this should have all of them. This has all of the, his contests right now. Not just this. Um, the next one is also January 25th. It's for DDA. It's back to Skyrim. Um, I'm playing with ideas for this one. Oh, good. Um, <coughs> I am thinking, and the reason why I'm sorting my furnishings is because I've changed my mind on something. I was going to use Moonbirth for the my entry into this, but it doesn't, because it has the right shape. It has to just go straight back, right? But it doesn't fit. It doesn't have enough slots. So what I was going to do was then change it to Grimhearth, and I spent some time last night working on Grimhearth. But I think I'm going to change that again. I think what I'm going to do is build a freestanding on my Grand Topal. And hopefully you will not even see anything of it. We're going to see if we can try to cover up even the boat and see if we can build it going straight back. And if I can do that, then I'm going to be able to move my build over to there and have it exactly the way I want it to look. The problem is there aren't enough houses that when you walk right in, everything is just right before you like a box. Um, and the only one I know of is Moonworth that's shaped like that. So I don't know what else to do. My voice is a little low because my husband's still sleeping and I'm trying to be nice and not wake him up. But um, what this is doing for me, this is pulling all of the furnishings I had out of Topol and putting them where they belong in other places. Because Topol was a storage house and now it's not going to be. I hope. I hope I'm going to be able to do this. Um, I'm not entirely sure I will. I spent a lot of time preparing and researching and even on my own spent to that time, but um, not entirely sure what furnishings I'm going to use either. I mean, what walls I'm going to use, but I, I'm, I'm suspecting I'm going to use those Breton ones. <laughs> um, you know, those Breton ones where the, the little building Breton ones. Good morning, Seraphi. Wait, which one are you talking about, Bayushi? I'm talking about Moonmirth, which is... That one's Khajiiti, not Reed. Um, we're in it right now, but you really can't tell because I'm putting furnishings in here. Oh, Topol. Uh, you're not going to see the reeds when I'm doing it. You're not going to see that with what I'm doing with it. 
So let's keep talking about contest while this is doing this. Uh, hello, Kit. January 28th, parkour. Um, have no flipping idea. That's another J Hart. Uh, January 30th, winter theme. That's going to be, uh, that's for ETU. I don't know. I don't know. I might be able to do something with my, with this other big project I'm doing, and maybe it'll cover multiple things. Um, January 30th, resolutions. I've, I just started it. It's, um, it's going to be, for me, it's going to be a Bosmer with salad. It's going to be a small build. It's not going to be much to it. That is also for J Hart. Um, then we have February 5th is going to be uh, for Housing's Finest Builders is the hideout for two, one to two people. We're going to be working on that. <laughs> Thanks, Serafi. And February 8th for DDA is going to be just a general love kind of concept. So uh, I have other d ideas for, for, um, if no, if you guys don't have ideas, we, c we talked about a whole bunch of them for, for different races, you know, like anger management for the orcs or AAA for the, uh, for the Nords or skooma treatment for, um, the Khajiit or Argonians. Uh, different things like that. I think we can cut, you can do a lot of things with that kind of stuff. Volunteering at a soup kitchen for Eleanor, you know, giving up slavery and doing your own work, like your own dishes and whatnot for a uh, dark elf, Telvani specifically. So many ideas and you can use any of them. I'm not going to be the least bit annoyed. Go ahead and use them. I know, Beishi she has a real issue with me saying that. She does not like me talking about, uh, talking about that. But it's the way it is. Because, like, you know, this is just, let's see what somebody does with it, you know? You don't have to agree with it morally. So those are all the contests that are, uh, that I know of that are going on right now. I, again, I apologize for my wet hair and my talking quietly. Husband's asleep and I was just impatient and I didn't want to wait for my hair to dry and I don't use uh blow dryers because they ruin my hair they like my hair is already like okay what's wrong with that oh god is that in is that in uh shimmerine or is that in Eleanor itself that's got to be Shimmerine, isn't it? I seem to remember that. There is just a naked Khajiit sitting in the top floor, isn't there? You know, I never really gave much thought to that. She's not the only one. If you go to uh, Shimmerine, one of the houses there has a naked Khajiit on the top floor. Also, he's just sitting on the floor. You should go. You should go look for him. I forget which house it is, but it definitely is there. Um, yes. Right. I think. Oh. I don't remember that enough. Uh, but anyway, so I'm going to have to deal with structurally building an item. Some, the thing I'm going to be working on and have been working on has been Breeze Home. I've been working on Bree's home for the interior for quite some time now. And I think now I'm going to have to work on the exterior. I think that's what I'm going to be building or trying to build in. God, this is going to be rough. I don't think I'm going to build the exterior. I think I'm just going to build the interior. So you just don't even see the exterior because it's otherwise it's just going to be impossible because there's too many pieces of things that you can't really that there isn't really any picture of and i actually believe it or not i actually got got the game reinstalled it fixed it 
and got it to the point where um let me go to my where i keep my structural stuff i actually played skyrim until i got to the point where i could go in it and take photographs I don't want to use any EHT in this because unfortunately people are biased and I want to actually show this to different people. I don't know. Hi Kriya. So the next thing is going to be just gathering together materials for it and then I'll show you where I'm at. Um, I'm glad I used screenshots because honestly, like the pictures I'm seeing online are all like modified. So this one is just a non-modified thing. All right. So I don't need any rocks or mushrooms. I do need structures. What should I grab? Skyrim's good. It's unfortunate that you didn't play it. It's a good thing. So the Breton stalls, I think are going to be my walls. Um, let me see. <laughs> all right, so that's pretty much all I can use from that. I'm going to have to buy or make some stuff. So what I'm going to do is go to Mornoth and grab, grab my crafting machines out of there. I don't want to do it, but I have to do it. Modded Skyrim is lovely. Um, I modded it to hell. But the portion that I'm dealing with now is um, I'd rather have it vanilla because I need to produce a vanilla copy of Breeze Home for this. This is going to be I'm going to submit it to ESO and see in Xenomax and see if they find it acceptable. Probably. But, you know, I was actually amazed at how pretty it still looked. I was looking at it and uh, pretty shocked at, at how good it actually looked after all these years. And I didn't use the new updated one. I was using the one that's... Uh, Whoa. What? 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 Ooh, I just undid something. Why is part of my effects missing? Why are part of my effects missing? Whoa. What? Who's, whose home am I making? I'm making Bree's home. The uh, four DDA's contest back to Skyrim. Um, so I'm going to recreate vanilla Breeze Home. And to do that, I want to have all of my machines in one place because unfortunately, like, they require, it, it's going to require a lot of creating my own stuff. <laughs> Yeah, so there, since there's Skyrim's coming out, I figured, you know, they might pay more attention to it. Bree? Breeze home. Like a breeze, wind. A breezy home. Why do I need more than that? I don't need more than that. Um, I'll show you what I've done thus far, but we're gonna, first we're gonna, uh, I have to look up something. So fashion floors. Well, I don't have to move them every time. I mean, I guess I could have a second step, but it's just a second, uh, a second, set but I feel like it's wasting I don't know I just feel like it's wasteful to have more than one all right so put this 
Bobby over here. We'll just stick everything over here. And then we'll do a rando. Come on, this Avi, don't be a bot. There we go. Hello, Tiana. We are going to build today. Um, so, first things first, I wanna check something floors uh, platforms I guess I'm looking for a particular design on the floor and I know it exists hmm Does anyone have elsewhere platform agent square that I could go over and look at the textures on? I need to see the bottoms and fashion, ESO fashion doesn't show the bottoms of ancient platform, agent square. Okay, Serafi, let me hit it after the... Me? No. No, it's the brick. No, I know it's brick, but on the t there's a crisscross one. There's one with like diamond crisscross patterns that I'm looking for. I'll show you what I mean. This is really annoying. Excuse me a moment. I'm going to show you what I need and then you can tell me what I should be using. Forgive me. I should have this on my computer anyway, so it's really not a big deal. I'm just, I'll show you, I'll show you what I mean, and then you can tell me which one I'm talking about. So you see how on this, this should, this should be popped up now. You see these crisscross ones? I know that there's, there are uh, floors that have this kind of crisscrossy pattern, and I'm trying to think of which one has it. If you guys can, if you guys remember Merck Meyer platform, okay, that solves some problems. Thank you. I'm glad I showed you the picture then, uh, because that's what I'm I'm going to essentially rebuild is this house. Okay. Well, let me make one and we'll see. I think I have it, and then we'll go do things. Structures. Mark Meyer wall. I should get this pattern anyway. I'll go get it. Oh, what a pain in the ass. Nothing's ever simple. Have you ever noticed? Nothing is ever simple. Mark Meyer platform sectioned. You are correct. Well, cheapo is relative, but Divine Design Alliance is selling it, my own guild, so we're gonna go there and pick that up. So, I wanna 
wonder who's selling it. it. Doesn't say who sells it. But Divine Design Alliance. So I'll go pick that up and then we'll we'll do other things. But I wanted to um, I want to get the textures just right. I want to get everything just right. It's important to me to get it to look pretty much identical. And I was so annoyed yesterday because I had it done. I had everything just so perfect um, it, in terms of uh, where all the items were. And then I realized, I was like, there is no way I'm gonna finish this within the item count of, Mer of Moon Mirth. Just impossible. So then I had to move everything over to the next best thing, which was Grim Hearth, which also isn't gonna work. So, Oh, wrong guy. Give me your things, sir. All of them. Give them to me. All right, we want, what's it called? Uh, plat platform? No, Merkmar. Merkmar. Merkmar! Merkmar platform sectioned. Thank you. Who sold this to me? Doesn't even tell you who sells it? That's lame. I want to know who I'm giving my money to. Lame. All right, so let's do a let's do a rando. Totally lame, lame, lame. I did go see your house, Sir Effie. You're Cyrodelic. I can't do it. I tried. Can't do it. Ain't happening. Sorry. Uh. So let's do Nick's tricks, because I know I was telling her I would take a look at her stuff, so let's go to her cold harbor. Yeah, uh, I was fine until I got in the house. Then once I got in the house, I was like, um, yeah, this isn't happening. Oh, absolutely. And most normal people can do it, but if you look at my page, if you scroll down to this page, Potato Facts of Life, number one, the Stabbies can't jump. <laughs> Stabbies cannot jump. <laughs> I did. I, I think so. I think so. But I didn't manage to get to. Uh, I was just hopping like crazy. But the, I don't. I didn't get. I couldn't climb up the into the second floor. That was just not going to happen. I don't know, Bayushi. Th throw me hard enough, and we'll see. <laughs> yeah i can't even do it when paying attention oh my god i see cute things i see cute things bouncing all right let me eat this eat it okay oh well look at the little bouncing plorp thing oh you're welcome i think that jay hart's gonna be able to do it i don't think i can and it might take him a few tries and i think that's exactly what you need you know we're looking to do so somebody went all out effects here this is nick strix this is uh 663 out of 700 items 148 out of 2000 uh effects so i'm actually really excited because i love it when um i love it when people use effects what does that say sometimes people use that without worrying about what it says but it Present your, present your N O Y N O S N O blank S R. I have no idea what that says. 
I just know it says present your something. Okay. Inside. So we've got how the oh that's an effect. I forgot that there's a heart picture effect. I was like, how the hell did they do that? So are they selling cats here? I mean, is that what's going on? That's what I want to know. Um, really nice usage as the paintings. I almost didn't notice that they were paintings at first. Lots going on here. Lots and lots going on. Trophy house, anus monster, sky, including a moon. So that's just probably an actual, wow. This is, this is really busy and bright. It's fun. It's a fun thing. It's like not playing around. Like I want bright and cheerful and, and interesting and they went for it. And frankly, I have no problem with that. I mean, I know some people find it very fake looking when people use the, uh, a lot of effects that are really bright, but if you're going for bright and fun, I mean, I did, uh, I did Candyland like that. If that's what you're looking to do, good for you. Go for it. I mean, look at that. You can't get much more bright and exciting than neon, you know? And I like the fish tank. I mean, and they're not poorly done either. I don't see very much flickering. And that goes really well, by the way. Those red, real red crystals next to the fake ones. Um, yeah, check that out. That's neat. That is really neat. Huh. You know, if you're going to go for it, go for it. Don't go halfway. Yeah, but Bayushi, you got to appreciate it for what it is. You can't, you can't go in. It's like going to the movies knowing that you're going to see something completely unrealistic, like, you know, a superhero show movie or something like that. In the twilight hours, hear our song. We gather here, so come along. We greet you kind, but keep in mind this coven is the best you'll find. Stay true to it and you will see it's home from home. This place can be so enter here with hearts fulfilled and harm you none do what you will that's actually really nice um you know you have to suspend your expectations of it looking super real and once you do that i think you can really enjoy what you're seeing more so oh well sorry My bad. All right, let's go down. This is stunning. I don't know what kind of, uh, what kind of fixture you would call this, but it's goddamn beautiful. So it's the, the purple light is what's, e what's not real here. But otherwise this is, this is incredible. Even without the effects. That's incredible and it's beautiful and it's totally going to go to, um, I'm totally going to send that to Chrissy and see if she can get Nick tricks to allow us to y submit this to the lighting fixture thinger. So let me do that before I forget because I have the memory of a, it's beautiful, whatever it is. I have no, it's just stunning. I'm a fan, big, big old fan. All right, sent to Chrysia. All right, and so these things, uh, you see these 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 guys? They're glow worms, I guess is the name of it. But I used them as uh, gummy worms when I did Candyland. I think they work. <coughs> I've seen people use them in red for a Valentine's Day house. I had no idea this was going to be this much fun of a house. The usage, the unusual usage of these, of the stained glass, just making it really big to, to be the bottoms of these mushrooms. 
very creative very creative and they're all different colors too it's just it's fun this person was definitely being creative and fun okay I think that might be it for I don't even know where I am anymore is this cold harbor this is cold harbor okay I completely lost track of where I was can you go through these no she 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 or he did put a an actual like that's real too where am I warping oh my goodness wow this is cool talk about warping I'm actually really really impressed this is cool Where does this go? To Cardi's? Grand Topol? I wonder why. For PvP Arena? Okay. And then this is going to a different Carl Harbor. And then lots of people's houses. This is wild. I'm actually really impressed by this. Really. I'm having a lot of fun with it. fun stuff okay so let me show you what I've done so far with with Breeze Home and I kind of ruined it because what I had originally done was I had it exactly how Breeze Home had it but since I'm since I changed my mind I moved things around so things don't look just right anymore now I have to fix it and I am sad oh well it is what it is <sighs> I'm just bummed by the news lately guys any of you US people it's just so hard so these are there temporarily temporarily as my normal building lights so what I do is I, I just stick these up in the air and eventually what I'm going to do is I, I hide them. But I left them visible because I wanted you all to see that you can hide them. I'm not doing anything on the second floor, by the way. So this will this was always intended. Not that I need to hide these because I'm going to be. Um, I'm going to be moving everything, but without without them. It's so dim in here, and, and that's why I want to show you how you can do this um, with these particular clockwork lights, because uh, I'll show you without. So that's what this looks like without those lights. Really dim. So eventually I may have enough light in here if I copy exactly. But here's the, you know, this is supposed to be I'll put I'll try to put them side by side if I can um I can't I didn't upload them so this is uh literally exact I copied it item for item <coughs> excuse me while I I send myself something I'm trying to import the pictures I took I did the stupidest thing um, what I did was I actually took screenshots with I took a picture with my iPad rather than screenshots in the game long story short I had reasons they were dumb but they were reasons um, all right let me show you what I'm talking about what I'm talking about in the January 2020. Okay. So this is when you first walk in. You see this picture? If you compare it, let me see if I can have it go side by side. It'll be difficult, but we'll give it a shot.
what pattern on top of the bookshelf. That's, that's part of the bookshelf. I didn't do it. That's just the Nord alcove bookshelf. So if you notice, I tried to do exact, but we don't have the same items. So I had to like kind of fake it with some of them. But the idea is to look identical as much as possible. That's the best I could do for that one. But I think it's pretty damn close if you look at it. Um, then there's this one that is the... Hold on. Where did I put this one? This. Um... So you see, it's got the Nord Lantern up top, and then I've got a, an urn. They don't have the same kind of urn, so it's not really possible. You can barely see it, but there are two pots and then a bowl in the middle on the shelves. And then there's three cups here and a bowl. And I tried to do exactly, I mean, I'm literally trying to do exact, but obviously the shelves don't match exactly, the, the, the you know, there's things that don't match exactly. I'll never be able to copy it exactly. Um, but the goal is to try to copy as much as I can. Um, but the first, the, the entryway to, to Bree's home, if you remember it, was, is, is kind of iconic. And so this is what I'm going to try to build is when you first walk in, um, this fireplace in the be in the beginning and then like the, it's just a straight back house with a wooden f ceiling and I'll put the Workmeyer uh, stairway here but I'm not going to have a second floor because there is no way I could reproduce at, at, you know to that level just no way so I've been gathering things together oh here's another one that I kind of want to show you this was hard work, so I don't mind showing it off a little bit. Uh, I spent hours and hours trying to get this to the place kind of where I wanted it to be. Where did it go? Here it is. <laughs> Here. So this is when you first walk in, in Bree's home. If it lets me show you. Oop, I went too far. All right, so what you should be able to see is that we've got a potato on a plate. I'll, I'll get them in the right order, of course. This isn't the right order. Potato on a plate, a jug, and a pitcher, and a bowl. So I tried to copy that exactly, even the chair location. So I'm going to try very hard. <coughs> to do this but you know it's 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 kind of I don't like copying but I guess that's what I'm going to be doing here but you know I've done plenty of stuff that's that's my own interpretation I think I know which one you're talking about that's a good idea. I'm going to write that down for the dream catcher. Okay, I'm writing it down. God, my pain is really bad this morning. Okay. You know, in a way, I'm sort of like, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. I just don't know if this is going to be even possible, but we'll give it a shot. All right, let's make that Merkmeyer floor thinger. And then we'll look at another house because I know it's really boring what I'm doing. 
I appreciate that. So what I'm going to have to do, and actually it's a good thing, it's a platform. What is it doing? Why didn't it make more than one? Or did it make more than one? Yeah, it did. Okay. Uh, what I'm going to have to do is because you can't put furnishings right by the door, and this is the door, I'm going to have to use EHT to actually get it to go by the door anyway and tell them, F you, EHT is going to let me do this. Tough no geese, that kind of thing. So first of all, I need to figure out, ew, there's mold on it, but it is the right shape. I'm going to need to figure out what direction it goes. So it's like, thanks for the follow. Thank you for the follow, stick out finch. So if this is where you come in, you'll of course have to, we'll have to move these closer, but we'll just say this is the general idea. God, this would be so much simpler just using EHT for everything, you know? I'm going to end up having to EHT this into a floor, but I just wanted to rough draft it as I always do. And so rough drafting, it just means like just throwing it here, seeing the general idea. Um, not trying to get anything perfect, but... And then assuming that's the right width, then I need to know what the next thing is <coughs> for the walls, which I need, um, I need wooden posts for, but I was thinking of using these as the walls. And what's nice about this is I don't have to worry about the outside of this this can this can look like crap and it doesn't matter like crap outside um, maybe I won't need posts all uh, there are probably only four posts that I'm gonna need really thick posts I'm trying to think of where I can find the exact right kind of thick posts That'll be our next thing to seek out. Is a fashion post. I think the only one that might work is the um, is this one with the barnacles on it. That is the only one I think might work. You guys might know better, but <laughs> that's what I'm wondering. Either that one, but the posts from the elsewhere goods are square. I want round, but it doesn't seem like this is really annoying. Why did you link there? I want, I want ESO fashion. That is true. Maybe I could sync them though. That might work. That, that could work. Does it bother you guys when I build? Like, I know that some people like it and some people feel like it's boring and would rather look at houses. So I just never know what to do. Um, okay. As long as you don't mind. Oh, okay. Well, hey, you know what? Yeah, because the ESO. Okay, so the the hacko shape of pillar will not work because that's that's square, and I need something thick and round. So we're gonna go with what Serafi's saying. I think with that ooh, the Merkmeyer totem wolf lizard has a good oh no it's got markings on it oh 
Oh, well, and plus you guys are helping me totally. You really are. If I sink the post barnacle covered into the ground, I think that might be the best one. Oh, well, good. I'm trying to show you guys how to do it the best way I can, but you know, I'm not perfect at this, but what, it, what helps me is I am stuck writing. Can't write for shit. I'm so stuck. But what I realized is the reason why I'm not stuck with building, but I'm stuck with writing is because there are bite-sized things. Oh, thanks, Scout Finch. I'm glad to hear it. It's just a slow process. That's the problem that I have. Um, I like to, sort of like a chef on TV, I like to have all the materials there for you guys and then just build it like I did with the potato, mostly. But the problem is, is that uh, I can't do that when I'm doing something like this where this is actually the process in which I'm doing it is I'm doing it one at a time, which is probably not the wisest way to do it. Um, but that's just the way that I'm doing it is one, one step at a time. All right. So post barnacle covered, let's get, let's get four of these. Um, I may need eight. So let's just get eight and save myself some time. Um, worst case scenario, a tree might work. I mean, we might be able to find a tree that would work. I have a ghost chicken. Just so you know, I have a ghost chicken. Um, the, but the per, so anyway, by I'm saying like five things at once. The bite-sized pieces with, with deadlines is super helpful for me for writing. I don't have that kind of thing, but I think uh, if I made myself like a calendar, a challenge calendar, I might be able to do that. We'll see, you know, <coughs> and maybe I'll get some more writing done. Oh, that's not good. So you come in looking this way. Well, then, before I get too far into it, we're going to rough draft, put it over here. Good to know. All right, so these, I'm gonna have to make a ton of these. That's fine. The other nice thing about this is it's, just, it's a short roof, so I don't have to worry too much about it being, yeah, that'll work. If I do it right, that'll work just fine. Um, it doesn't have to be over the crack. We'll figure something out. This is all just rough drafting in anyway, so why am I worrying so much? Okay. Hey, Zemesis. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, so writing is really what I took building up to do. It was like, I need to learn how to be creative. And so I, I did, but, so this'll, this'll do. This'll be just fine. This will do, pig. And of course, nothing is lined up properly. Don't don't think for a second that it's going to look like that, because um, it's not. All right, so let's try to break this up with with housing. Looking at housing, so it's not all just Karen trying to build shit. But we're gonna get, we're gonna do this. I I have faith now. I think together we can build this, and it, it should be. It should be entirely possible. I think I may need another floor though. I think it's gonna go back further than the, than just the three. All right, let's do a big one. Let's go to Charolais. Charolais is amazing. So let's see what she did with this atrocity of mold. Oh, good. Cause this is gonna be quite the project. My cat's still alive, everyone. 
He's he's he is rallying. I thought for sure we were gonna lose him the other day. Absolutely thought so. Um, but I made the call. We called our vet and said, you know, he's he's falling over. This is happening. You know, what do you think we should do? And the vet reviewed his meds and said, you know, you guys have done this before. You've been down this rodeo with, with his brother. You you know him better than I do at this point. Oh, God, it's so perfectly Charolais beautiful um, already. So they said, you know, go with your gut. And so our my gut said, reduce the meds. Oh, look at that. With Vivac? How smart is Vivac, Vivac's pool as part of a light source? That's crazy good. Uh, wow. It is no longer moldy. She has pleased me with this. So, um, I decided that I was going to reduce one of his, uh, diuretics. And it's like, overnight, he's doing so much better. This is beautiful. And look at all the beautiful effects, too. She's got some gorgeous stuff going on. We reskin the walls. I wonder if these would work better than the Merkmeyer ones, but I don't think so because they're not the right shape. Whoops, cancel. I just want to walk through here. She doesn't want us back there. Okay. Worst case scenario, I can always replace it, right? nothing is permanent oh my god look at all the beautiful stuff people are making i'm in love with it this is a uh, waterfall over blue crystal and mushrooms and wedding lights and coral and crystals and then she reskinned the roof with real stuff and the walls with EHT because item cap is going to be a beast if she doesn't. I love the hand fast trees. People have been using them a lot more lately. And this is a, a it's almost like a triptych painting more than a window. I like it. She closed off part of, part of the house too, I think. No, actually, I think that's just a wall. So let's see what's down in the sneaky, sneaky area. There is a little cave in the sneaky, sneaky area that I will show you. And a polar bear, apparently. Proof that you can reskin this house to not be heinous on the inside. A nice little grotto. Very pretty grotto for sitting and enjoying. And smoking some skooma, as you do. As one does. You know, it would probably be, be cheaper for me, mat-wise, to just buy all of the pieces of, of structural stuff I need. But reality is, is that it isn't always for sale. Right? I wouldn't know, dudes. But I'll take your word for it. I am a prude when it comes to drugs, except for prescription pain pills. Um, I take them when I need them. Interesting. Am I supposed to see what's over here? No. Okay. I knew this was going to be a, a really cool, interesting one to look at. Look at that little lamp next to a chair. It's so peaceful. Excuse me. Okay. Nice job, Charlotte. I'm sure it's not done knowing her. She's probably going to be adding more to it, but I think I do think it's stunning the way it is. Oh, look. This is beautiful. I would just want to sit here, which I guess is the point. I need more coffee. 
I'm dying. <laughs> that was uh mr mr doom making fun of me because i i was whining about not having enough coffee he said oh no he's not he doesn't care about my my pain my suffering you will he's going to mourn me so i guess i need probably at least eight more of those Breton thingers. So let's go make them. Need eight more Breton thingers and then another of the Merkmire floors. And then we'll build a little bit more. And then I'm going to make some of those elsewhere wood platforms as a ceiling. I need to figure out what kind of carpets I'm going to use because, you know, when I was looking at the, the picture, the closest the carpet looks like is actually, um, I had four more. The, actually, the, the, the closest the carpet looks like is, is actually a Merkmeyer carpet. So I'm not sure like what to do about that. So this was uh, the floor. Mark my floor. <laughs> One more. And then I need those Breton fingers. Where's my wood one? Did I not bring my wood one over? Clothing. Is it still in my inventory? Nope, must have left it in, Mer in the other one. We'll go back, Myrna. Get my wood one back. That was dumb. Stupid. Mornoth keep. I made it into a little town, and I think my favorite thing to do is do crafting in a little town, but it would be too much work to go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth all the time. Sadness. Yeah, I did leave it. Look at it. I'm such a dumb butt. <laughs> Part of the question I have for myself um, is, do I use effects to supplement the build and then the people who see it see it and the people who don't, don't? Because there's certain items that... <laughs> I'm not sure I'm going to be able to reproduce. I'm not, I'm not sure at all. All right. Wow. I guess you come in facing that way. That's just odd. Whatever. Next time I come in, I got to be really careful about seeing which way I actually come in. Come on, don't be stupid there. All right, we need the Breton thingers. Breton stalls, let's try eight. Boom. This is a very expensive project. I can tell you that already. Without even having done it yet going to be expensive. These are underrated for for crafting type gillies, these uh, Breton thingers. I think they're really good structural items. <laughs> mainly, mainly because of the, the masonry, the framed masonry. Very European. Um, I like it. All right, so yeah, I think I need another one. It may not be exact, but... We'll see.
You're a waddle and daub. You waddle and daub. <laughs> I have no idea what that means in terms of me saying it about you. I know what waddle and daub is. I just like saying it about you. Because it's fun. There you go. Oh, I know. You think I don't know? I know. I'm just messing with you, man. All right, light posts, because we will get to the point where I'll need them. All right, let's get the, the roofing and the other stuff like that built. I'm going to use the elsewhere floor, like wooden ones, wooden floors, <laughs> platform. Ooh, do I use this? I'm going to have to use the big one. Let's see how much space two does. And then I need the Wer Merkmeyer Marshwood one ramp. Yeah, that's what I need. I'm actually having fun doing this. Like... You know, the, the game did not contain what I needed, so I'm making it. That kind of is fun to me. All right, so let's see. Ooh, this mountain, this is perfect. The bottom portion looks exactly the same. Oh, wow, I'm stoked. I am so stoked by this. You just don't even know. This pleases Karen's greatly. And potatoes, since I'm a potato. And then I need a stone wall at the back, but I know exactly what to use. And then the stairway going up. Oh my God, this is gonna be so exciting. Gonna have to start building it like for real soon. I need two Merkmeyer walls. Wait. I may have them. Derp. Hub. Hub. Oh, screw you, hippie. <sighs> All right, fine, I'll make them. Merk my, Merk my walls. I guess you're not, I guess you're not enchanting. Then what the hell are you if you're not enchanting? I want the Merkmeyer wall stone. Am I stupid? Like what, what type of thing is this? Enchanting. It says it's enchanting. I must not have the recipe. Weird. Structures, fences. There it is. I don't have hackling little plumage, plumage. Who has hackling plumage, please? I am going to need you. One of my guilds has it. So 
I will buy it from my guild even if it's at a premium. Because <laughs> that's what I do. <sighs> Forget this. Yeah, if I ever need any structural items or materials, even if it costs more, I try to buy it from in-guild. <coughs> Support the guild as much as I can. Moo. Moo moo. Moo. Moo moo moo. Moo. Have you guys ever played um, Diablo, the first one? With the cow level that they said they didn't exist? This was like, oh my god, it must have been like 25 years ago at this point. Something crazy like that. And when you played it, if you did get to the cow level, Ever since I saw that, even though it's, uh, even though it was so long ago, there's at one point where the cow goes, moo, 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 moo. And I've been saying it like that since. I have to find a video of that at some point. In materials, we need hack wing. Is that a style? That's a style. There. That'll do for now. And then I'm going to use EHT to properly shape this. Once I have all of the pieces, I will shape it. And then I'm going to use EHT to move it closer to the entrance. So I think we'll see, you can see how EHT works for building straight walls, etc. I should be able to. Okay, I'm gonna do something crazy here and put down the poles the way that I was facing there. That way I can move it properly later. Oh, I'm happy to, I'm happy to help as much as I can. All right, so the trick with Merc Mile walls is they're not shaped right. See, they have that kind of oddly shaped top. So you always have to use two if you want it to look like a decent wall. <laughs> kind of annoying, but that's the reality of the situation. And as you can see, you probably, maybe you can't see just yet, but the, um, the light is going to still be there even though, okay. Well, isn't that annoying as F? Because I only, oh wait, I can get away with just using one. Huh. Maybe. Maybe not. But this is what the back, the back of it looks like. All right. So I think I have the EHT now. I think that's really all it comes down to. So I will show you what to do. All right, so first we're gonna make the floor. So we're going to open up EHT and we're gonna select all items, same as target. We're gonna target those four, right? We're gonna do builds, we need four items. I want no spacing at all. Unfortunately, no spacing. Remember that items have natural space around them anyway when, when the builders made them, the devs made them. So sometimes there's extra space. Negative one is usually enough to get rid of it all, but I may have to change that after. We'll see. Uh, this is in a circle. I do not want this in a circle. I want this in floor. And we want four items width of one item. Let's see what it does. Okay. It would help if I wasn't inside of it. Jeez. 
All right, I can't. Move it, move it. This is ridiculous. I need to get out from underneath it, please. Thank you. <sighs> Stupid. All right, so negative one is too much. Let's do, go back to zero and see if zero is enough. I'd say negative point one. So there is a space in between, you can see it. Now there isn't. I do think that should be all right. Now we're gonna move it to where I wanted it. I had set the first poles to where I want it to go. This should, you know, the direction. So I see the two poles there in the front. Those should do it. Those should be the ones. Okay. We'll get those just right between it. Back a little so I can possibly come in on it. We'll see. So that's step one. Um, Actually, it went the wrong way. It went, uh, I need to flip it 90 degrees. I always forget which one it is. Okay, so we're gonna do, come on, we're gonna do change these items, uh, each item. Rotate, flip group, no, I want to flip each item. Mm. Did he remove an option? I'm trying to find the flip group. All right, that's not what I want. I want to flip each item, so. What we're gonna do is with the build itself, we're gonna have to do it that way. With four item orientation. Okay, I'm gonna admit to you that I don't know which one it is. So it's obviously not pitch because that one goes up and down. So we do the next one. That is what I wanted. All right, down. Okay, so now they're right. Now they're shaped right. So what I did there was, I can never remember which item orientation, I, it, which one is which. So it turns out it's yaw. I didn't want these guys to be lengthwise. I wanted them to be widthwise because they're shorter this way and I had planned it out this way. The real trick to this though is make sure you use item orientation and not overall orientation because all Oriole overall orientation would have done is just turn the whole structure, not each item. And that wouldn't have been what we wanted. So now I'm gonna move this. By the way, I could just pick this up and move it, but I'm not gonna do that because that isn't what I really want. Um, let me get this back again. And then we'll do confirm. I'm gonna do build, build, down, okay, forward, oh, fuck, I forgot, 
Um, I do not have absolute directions on, so everything goes based off of how I'm standing. So like, for instance, up. Uh, Karen. Sorry, being annoyed now. That needs more negative three, maybe? Now you know, this is really what EHT is. It's building in little bits of, of just try this, try this. And it's not it's not like everybody who does this knows what they're doing because they don't. Most of us just know that we're trying to do what we're doing and that's it. So we're just figuring it out as we go along like everybody else. People tend to think that people who know a little bit about EHT tend to, and work with it tend to know how to do everything with it and we really don't. I don't know anyone who knows how to do everything with it. Okay. Okay. Um. Let's hope that worked. Okay. Next thing. We're going to clear this. Even if you know what you'd use, it's still a problem. And then what I'm going to select next time is, well, first of all, I'm going to reset this whole thing. Then I'm going to do ah, cancel. And I'm going to do cancel. What are you building? You shouldn't be building anything. I'm going to go to a different house and hope that this goes away. That should not have happened. When you click build, when there's nothing selected, nothing should come up. Nothing should happen. So that's, that's some sort of error. Let's go to Ginger Snaps Enchanted Snow Globe. I could swear I did her Enchanted Snow Globe, but maybe I didn't. Actually, coming back in is probably a good way to test it anyway. That's not what I've discovered. I'll tell Cardi about it, though. I might direct him to the exact spot so he can see what I did and tell me what I did wrong because it's probably something I did wrong, to be honest with you. Usually is. Please work. Please go away so I don't have to reload UI and not get back in. And Oh, it's still there. So this is Ginger Snaps. Uh, um, enchanted. I, and this is very expensive, by the way. I'm going to have to reload UI anyway. That sucks. Sadness. I got this guy, too. I didn't buy him. He came out of, of a crate. I got it, but... Like, I did buy the crate, so I guess I bought them. A lovely little icy grotto down there. People tend to put a lot of icy grottos in. Lots of dudes hanging out outside. Oh, these are great lamps to use with this. 
the icy look really comes across if you use those Telvani Lance, the Azure ones. Looks like Christmas lighting if you use those crystals like that. I wonder if this is supposed to be like a holiday house or something. Yes, it's got the different stuff. <laughs> Yep, Holiday House. A kid doggy hanging out under the Christmas tree. Lots of details. Four ninety nine out of six hundred items. Not counting, you know, gallery items and whatnot that don't count in that. All right, nothing up in the storage area, which is fine. Putting individual items in there. Oh, use the cubbies, you make me so happy. Cubby user. All right. I'm gonna just go to a random place and then I'm gonna reload UI because life sucks and then I die. Annoying. All right, so I've got those pieces I need. What is the next thing I'm gonna need? Actually, I think next I can start furnishing. Now, one of the problems I have is that a Khajiit fire pit is actually like the perfect thing to use, um, but it's Khajiit-y, so I don't know how they're going to look on that. I'm going to take a quick bio break while this is not reloading, so be right back. See? See? What did I say? Totally knew it wasn't going to come back. Because God hates me. Or EHT. Or Zoss. One of them. Somebody. Anybody. Typical. Yeah. Happens to me all the time. <coughs> and usually, I can try to re remove like turn off some of the some of the add-ons but I don't have much going as you can see there's very little Jeez. I guess I could turn off if that doesn't work we'll see 
It's really annoying. I shouldn't have to play without playing certain add-ons. But that's the way it's been going, and it's really annoying. Really annoying. I, uh, there's a there's a guild called Urbo Uroboros. I can never say that right. Um, they're holding a housing c competition. I am offering to provide all the prizes on NA. I've got it. What the hell else am I doing with it? Um, and sponsoring it on the NA portion. Per per Words are hard. Because on um, they're doing the EU and they said, sorry, we don't have anyone on NA with that kind of money. But I'm like, well, I have the money on NA for it. I'd be happy to. So that's what I'll do if they let me. You know, the last time this happened, it like then hung up and I couldn't uh, I couldn't do anything. It just it just hung. Really annoying. But while this is loading, we can look at that picture again and you can tell me if you agree with me about ideas. So sorry about this, that it's such a crappy photo. It is literally a picture of my screen because I'm a dumbass. Um, I don't know what furnishing to use for this. Do you guys see this thing that I'm, I'm mousing over this particular item, this, this triangle thing? Is there anything that looks like that? Or do I have to build something that looks like that kind of tripod shape? It's not even a tripod. It's more of a... I mean, I could build it if I had to, but I wouldn't want to. I don't know what to use for that. Breton long shelf. But it doesn't have those long bits on the bottom. You see what I mean? The legs? I'm wondering about the legs. How do I how do I make the legs? I do want to be pretty much as specifically maybe. I just want it to be as accurate as possible. Maybe just use a flat tabletop and build it, build the legs myself. Yeah, it does. I just don't know how long they are. It'll be pretty short. Or I could add to the legs. Maybe I could add like a another shelf to the legs or something. I don't know. I want to say that there's like a halalu table that that almost looks like that, but I'm probably wrong. Just a thin table that I could swear exists. The halalu hangers might work for the for the feet. The use of something useless otherwise. I think that's what I'm going to use. The halalu hangers. For the legs. If I ever get into the game again, which from the looks of it I'm not.
what long single long boards. Killing ESO, starting over again. Because God hates me. ESO is pissing me off so much lately. What are single longboards? What single boards? What does you mean? Like planks? Are there single planks? Let me look. Let me look them up. I am willing to. Do any sort of research we need to do. Those might work. The the one desert flame looks more accurate. I don't know. I could swear there's a table though. Like a thin table. I, I'm losing my damn mind, but I swear. Maybe it's not considered a table. You know? And I, I want to say for sure that it is one of the, the Dark Elf items. All right, let me close this. It's a Dark Elf item. And it's like a hallway table. In, in real furnishing, it would be considered a... Oh, God, what are those tables called? The ones that you just... Oh, forget it. I, I know words, and then they disappear from me, and then I don't know words anymore. Thank you, Trestle. Trestle, I love you. Trestle. You got it. That's what I was looking for. The trestle. Wow. The Nord trestle. There is an exact table like that. The Nord trestle. You just solved my problem. Thank you, dear. That's, that's absolutely right. This pleases me greatly. This is why I like working with you guys. You always help. You know? You really do. This is not going to be easy, and I, I really do appreciate your help. The legs go the wrong way, but I don't care. It's good enough. It is exactly what that is. Wait, do the legs go the wrong way? Not really. No, the legs are right. Okay. If I ever get back in again, there we go. Okay. Um, just going to make sure I'm going to make this with in here because I don't know if I have that recipe. And if I don't, I need to buy it. This is how I get most of my recipes. I just become a crazy recipe, excuse me, person. All right, so what was I making? Other than the recipe, other than the Nord Trussel, there was something else I was making. Or maybe everything just crashed. <laughs> this is actually fun. As, as hard as it is, it's gonna be, this is fun to me. I know that some of my people who watch me aren't really into the building that much, so they may not find it fun. But to me, it is. 
Okay, so that would be, I would assume parlor. Maybe not. Hmm. Dining. Nord table, Nord counter, no Nord trestle. Guess what I'm, I'm buying? Oh, there's one being sold in one of my other guilds. If I can remember places. Uh, I, in my, on my alt account, I member, I'm a member of the auction house, so I'm going to go buy it there. Wow. I hope it's still there. I guess these are the kinds of things that not a lot of people are looking for at any given time because it's so specific. So I don't have to worry about them being sold while I'm looking for them, but don't you just hate that? Yeah, I got to do one at some point, but I don't need to do it right now. Right now, I just want to, you know, this is the boring portion, and I'm sorry for that, but um, and this is Nord. And there it is, Nord Trussell braced. I don't know. Ow, everything hurts. Oh no, my pearls fell off. Those are my mom's pearls. They have a bad clasp. I need to fix them. Let's see how it looks when I get in. Like if it's turned the right way. If I can even get in or if I, do I load it like inside something. so weird like I'm gonna put something down that shows exactly where I'm facing there then we'll show what direction I'm facing And then we were going to do this and then everything got screwed up. All right. So EHD again, geez, let's do this right. So we're going to do all, no, we want individual items because there are eight of these and I don't want to use all eight. Actually, no, no, no. Uh, I could, but I won't. Sometimes it's simpler to do all of them and then just take the four you need, but whatever. All right, we've got five. We'll just do it twice, whatever, you know. Let's figure out how to do this then, folks. All right, builds, five items. Five long, zero width. Let's see what way it goes. I'm really, it's really getting old to be inside things, you know? All right, so it is the right direction, but the space between it is too much. So we need to remove some space. So let's do the one negative one again. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Exactly what I needed. B. 
beautiful. I think Vu Dang was the one who said that uh, for, for building EHT is essential. And she's so right. Because otherwise you couldn't you couldn't do something like this. Make it absolutely perfectly shaped, you know? And then to me, it's, it's, it would drive me nuts to not have this be right. And unfortunately, they don't give us the tools. I mean, I know, I know Cardi is working on it. He's the last person I'm complaining about. Um, all right, I need to make the changes a little bit bigger, but not much. Beautiful. What do you guys think? I think beautiful. I mean, you got to look at it from the... From the, from the viewpoint of this is a work in progress and it's not properly shaped yet. But it will be eventually. So select. Okay. Great. I lost everything. Whatever. I know how to do it again. Five, length five. Thanks, false at all. Uh, item spacing, negative one. Once again, builds right on top of me. All right, so we got to flip this one. Yeah, this is going to be a fun, fun project. It's not going to be exact by anyone's measure, but I'm trying to get it as close to looking like the real thing as possible. Um, what I what I always want to encourage people to remember is that um, If it does not look perfect to you at first, don't fret because um, you can always fix things. And for example, like this pole isn't right anymore, you know? So what? I'll fix it. No big deal. Uh, none of this is framed the right way. When we first get in, we've got to change the direction to the way the flowers are going but I'm not dealing with that because I'm dealing with this. So the next thing will be doing the ceiling. And I almost always use floor as my preferred build shape. There's other things you could do like wall or whatever. Whoops, cancel. We're going to select those and then we're going to make them into two with one. Let's see. How much of a space do you put between them? Too much space. Let's do a negative one. Or and actually, let's do a negative five because negative one looks like it's going to be too much. When I say negative five, I mean negative point five, not negative five because that would be huge. Um, there you go. Perfect. I think it may have done the same thing again where it turned it, but I'm not sure that it, that it matters with the ceiling. Let's see. All right, forward. People saying that, you know, they're still learning EHT. I hope 
I hope this is helpful. If not, you know, if you have specific questions, I can tell you what I know. Um, but this is really how I do it. You know, this is my, this is my actual building style. So wait a minute. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. So if you're wondering about why I'm trying to get to a specific point standing a certain way. It's because of directions when I move this. I have tried doing it as a, as setting it as, as normal, what are they called? Directionals, but unfortunately it does not work for me. It just doesn't. I have trouble with it. So I prefer to use it this way. All right, let me see if I have the Celestia. Do I have, yeah, I do have it on. Okay, cool. Magic carpet. It is important in life. Um, really important. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so what's next? What's next is we're gonna move it. We're gonna move the whole thing. So we're gonna pick housing tools. How do you off? Hmm. How are you off? Oh, dirt. Okay. Okay, what we're gonna do is select all items in the house. Then we deselect the things we don't want to move. I'm going to leave the barnacle posts where they are so I have a, a directional idea of which way I'm going. but I think I've got everything else. All right, so then I hit, I'm gonna get back on my magic carpet ride. The plants are, as you can see, direct, they're, they're in that direction. So let's move items as a group. And try to get it on the same angle. I'm trying, I'm trying. Oh, that looks like it's right, doesn't it? Um, that's it. I can show you the EHT. Gotcha. No. All right, this may work. Let me stick these poles where we want them, wherever that may be. Not those poles. We got other poles. It's important where you put your poles. That's all I'm saying. All right, so now we fix this back piece. Ooh, 
Am I missing a piece? Did I lose one or am I too small? Oh, no, I gotta move this up further. Derp. Something's wrong here. I know what I'm doing wrong. Crap. I left off move items as a group, so every time I moved something, everything moved. I hate when I do that stupid shit. Let me undo. Okay, I think this is right. Oh, what a mess up. What a mess up. At least I have, I think. No, I don't have the direction right. Shoot me in the head, please. Okay, thanks. Bye. I'm not even going to rely on those flowers anymore. I'm not sure how they're going to work. So, Just one setting, folks, can screw everything up. So you got to be careful. What a pain in the ass. Pain in the ass. Pain in the ass. However, in general... This looks pretty good. I am, in general, quite pleased. So let's go to our, um, go pick up some of the furnishings we have in Grim, Grim Hearth's Well and see how we can do this. So. I'm kind of psyched. I'm kind of psyched, folks. And I'm finally using this stupid house. Mr. Doom, are you getting me coffee? No. Oh! Are you getting me a croissant? No. No! You're getting bored yourself. That's fine, too, but just can you get me the other stuff, too? No love. You hear him say no. So what we're going to do is select radius. Because I want to move this exactly how it is. Actually, I don't probably don't need to, but we'll, we'll do it that way anyway. So we'll select all these items. We hit select again. Then we go into copy paste. I'm going to clear this out. Because I don't need that anymore. And I'm going to do... Cut and selection. Now, I want to do this bit by bit because it gives me more chances, first off, to see how to fix that entry because I don't think that entry way is going to work. I think I have to move it. I'm going to have to really tweak it. But also because it, um, I think I think this is doable. I really do. I actually, I actually didn't think it was doable for the longest time. So I think I need to put three poles in, not two. And then I have to use those dread, those dark elf hangers to make the right bracings. All right, so this is, this isn't so bad. Let's do, We could do this. We could do this. I have faith. All right, down. Okay. 
Okay, I think this should do it. Whew. I'm scared. I hope this works right. All right, so three poles. One, two, three. Maybe. I'll fix the, the stupid part about the, uh, with the barnacles in a bit. I just want to get these generally where they belong because that's how I roll. Oh man, I'm so stoked about this. This is really gonna go the way that I expected and I'm kind of like really psyched about it because I didn't expect it. I'll close this off too eventually, but for the moment, like I could probably stick this here. But we'll just, we'll just leave it there for the moment. Boop, 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 boop. Barnacle posts. Wait, did I have all three? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Back wall. You are right. Okay. So we're going to paste that very thing that I just picked up. I hope it works. We'll go into, well, first, copy paste. We're going to do paste from inventory. Confirm. Then we do bring to me. And there it is. Exactly how it should be. Go right. This goes right by the door as you walk in. It's on the left. And then I want to show you how what I mean when we put it. I'm gonna put it side by side for a moment. Crazy me. Alright, so there's that. Looks like the pole is just here. Let me, let me look at what you're seeing. All right, you're not seeing this in a very helpful way. Chairs. Mm -hmm. One is up again. Oh! No, one is up against the wall like that, sort of. I don't care if you can use the chairs or not. This does not matter to me. Uh, okay, you go over here. Where's the second chair sitting? Second chair is facing inwards. Yes, yes, yeah, too close to the entrance. I'll fix that in a bit. The bowl is in the back. Uh, pictures in the middle. The plate and the potato are right here. So, first step, what do you think? Aside from the chair that I've got to put there because it's too close to the big entrance. I'd say it's pretty accurate, right? I mean, I think it's pretty accurate. That doesn't mean I'm right.
I'll fix that. Don't worry. All right. So next thing. Let's go get the next thing, shall we? This is this is crazy. I can't believe I'm actually doing this. I really didn't have much hope that this was going to work like this. We'll get it off the boat in a minute. I just need to come back in again and have it work that way. I'm so scared. Nobody's going to get it. I just have this feeling that no one's going to get it. They're going to walk in and they're going to be like, what's this? And have no idea. I hope people played enough of um, enough Skyrim that they recognize uh, that they recognize this. I hope so, Valsado. I hope so. It actually makes I'm really actually quite nervous about it. I'm probably more probably more nervous than I need to be, but All right, so now this guy now this guy will come in. And we'll do copy paste, clear clipboard, cut. I'll feel a lot better being able to decorate this now, knowing that it fits. Because when I was building it in here, I was really worried about 400 items not being enough. But if I can do this and have it fit, I'll feel a lot better about it. This is going to be like the longest stream ever, and I'm so sorry. Maybe I should just cancel it and stop showing you guys this stuff. I don't know. It's up to you if you want to keep watching this crap. But this is real building. This is the way that it works. It's just you sit there and you keep going until you get it done. And sometimes it takes a long time. Actually, that loaded quite well. All right. So what we'll do is we'll select none. And then I want to see the picture while I'm placing this particular item because it's really important. Yes, I know I'm I'm in the middle of the floor. We'll figure something out about that sooner or later. So I gotta build a little. Um, I'll build something in the middle that this can be in the center of, like a, a fire pit, because that's that's what's normally there. And then we have two chairs. One here. One here. I may have to make this wider. We'll see. Like the entire building. But I may not have to. We'll see. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. This is right over the fire, so if that's right over the fire, got this, got this, and then hearth, we've got the fish hanging here. And then the uh, garlic hanging here I might buy like three more strands of garlic because that's what it actually has and I'm particular enough that I might actually care what it actually has All right. so let's do 
the next paste. You go up front. And then we'll move everything around and make it everything look right, okay? Paste from inventory. And that is this. So this will go bring to me. Can I please not be in the middle of everything I put down ever? That would be nice. Okay, let me see what you're seeing. All right, you're seeing it fine. Okay. So this is what we're gonna try to copy. So we'll rotate this sucker. I don't like that it doesn't have the flat top, but there's not much I can do about that. And I don't like that we don't have blue cups or anything, but you know, I'm doing what I can. but then it looks lalu and here's the deal i don't want them to think that i didn't go authentic so i'm being really careful about what i'm using i don't know i'm trying to stick to nord but we'll see it may not work mm. Like, I don't want them to, you know, if I submit this to Zoss to look at and maybe do whatever they do with it, um, I don't want them to say, oh, well, this is nice, but there's, you know, you have Lalu stuff in here, you know? I don't want that to happen. Okay, so weapons, weapon rack is going to be a problem. I still haven't figured out what to do about the weapon rack, honestly. I, I think I, I can do something, but I'm not sure what yet. close not perfect but pretty close right I'm hoping what two achievement swords it's not about what to hang in there it's the it's making the the it's making the rack that's gonna be the problem Yeah, it's it. I want it to be exact though. The rack is empty in the plane one, so like I gotta figure out how to make a rack. Are you kidding? This stream is never ending. This is the stream that never ends. It's the stream that goes on and on, my friend. Some people started streaming it. Yeah, it's right in front of you, or it was. Uh, hold on. That. See it? Straight ahead. It's this thing. This thing right here. Yeah, that's what that is. So, 
I know it's annoying. I know it's weird looking. I, it took me a while in the real game to figure out what the hell it was. Um, but what I'm gonna do, I need to remove this so I can build things. I need to make some, uh, some things. I know that's really incredibly helpful. Some things, but that's how I roll. Okay, dark elf hangers. Hopefully won't look dark elfy. What are those under? Are those metal? I hope they're not metal. No, I know. You telling me as if I didn't know. I know, all right. No, it was a different post. It was a different post. It was not the Dark Elf hangers. It was a Dark Elf post. Moo, moo, moo. Moo, 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 moo. Breton Street Post Plain. That looks like it a little bit. There's a post I'm looking for. I don't remember which one it is, but there's a post that looks right. Posts and pillars. I'm trying, I'm trying to find it. That's what the problem is. Uh, once I find it, I'll show it to you. I promise. I guess I gotta go with... I'll make one. And we'll see if it works. But the Breton Street Post stone might work. or Breton Street Post Plain woodworking. Hopefully I have it. Yeah, I don't want it to be actually an actual post. I'll show you what I'm gonna use it for. Hey, Les Lox. Nice to see you. I'll show you what I'm gonna use it for. We're thinking about using it for. Okay, so let me get the picture out again. You see those big um, holders on the posts? I'm trying to think about how to deal with that. And I was thinking maybe this would work. If I put them on the posts, I might be able to duplicate that look a little bit. I would have to move the, I have to move the pole around. So just give me a, a second. Nope, not gonna work. I mean, I could just skip them. They just annoy me that it's so, these are too small. I'm trying to get the arch. You see the, I have the pole. Um, see, I have the poles already. What I wanted is this, this support beam there which this button thing has, but it's too small. So it doesn't quite 
work for what I'm trying to do, which is make it stand in for that. Um, I may be able to fake it with, with some other piece of furnishing, but it's not this, if that helps. I'm thinking one of the uh, trestles actually might work or yeah I'm not a builder type person so I can't I can't come up with the word I'm thinking of but I'm thinking like maybe the Redoran trestle might work for that I don't know We'll try it. I think I can make it. I, can, I think I can. I think I can. Um, let's try it. Man, you make it so much useful, useless furnishings when you're, when you're doing this. <laughs> All right, table or parlor. Rider in. Wait, what is this? Dining, dining. Well, let's, let's see if I can sink it in a way. I don't even have the freaking thing. Yeah, I don't have it. What about the dark elf trestle? How is, how is that legs work? No. Let me see. That might work. I see what you're getting at. I have one. Let me test it. Yeah, you're right. Let me test it. You're absolutely right. Uh, I have it in my hauntings. You're smarty pants, smarty pants. See, and I tell people, guys, like people help me with this. Uh, my viewers actually help with this. It isn't just me playing it by my, building it by myself. You guys have helped with multiple builds. Hmm. Well, Greek Bound's pretty damn smart, so. My friend is going to make such fun of me. He's going to mock me so hard for this. He's like, how long your stream is. Oh, I forgot to eat that trestle. Eat. All right, so here's that thinger. I have one. Let's go back. What do you think? You think this is going to work? I'm like kind of nervous about it, but I, because I want it to be good. I want it to be really good and come out just right. Even if my hair is poofy. Where is, you know what annoys me? It doesn't tell you how long you've been streaming. Like, I can't see how long this stream has been so far. Like, there's no timer anywhere. If any of you know, tell me, because I have no idea. All right, let's see if this works. Whew. River hold defense. First of all, put this down. Then I'm going to turn off my... Or deselect my EHT stuff. I don't want to mess anything up while I'm doing this. Okay, next. I want to have the picture up too. That would kind of help. <laughs> A little bit. All right. Oh, that's not nearly as bad. I thought it was way worse. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I think it's gonna work. I think it's gonna work. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's going to work. That's going to work. Hold on. You kick ass. You kick so much ass. It's not as, it's not as curly, but for right now, that's as good as we're going to do. I think not bad. I'm happy with it. Okay. Now I'm going to make that trussel too, real quick. My, uh, the other trussel. Nordic trussel. It looks really weird from the outside, doesn't it? I guess it kind of does from the inside too, but I got to figure out something with making the roof more solid because you can see right through it. I'll find some other platform thing I could put over it. Oh, thank you. Okay, so that's got to go like, we'll say right there for now. And you need to turn or sink so you don't have as much crap on you. All right. And then I had that other one. This guy I had started. You make me so happy that you knew that. This pleases me greatly. I was really nervous that no one was going to get it. All right, next step. I need to make this pole come here so that no one can see this ugliness. Maybe push that a little further back too, but we'll, we'll fiddle with things after. All right, so where's my parlor stuff? Yeah, it's Bree's home. That's the hope. The hope is that it's Bree's home. Uh, I actually went and started the game again so that I could actually, you know, see if I could do it. I took screenshots. The next step is this guy right here. So let me see if I have that. I'm so glad you guys got it. Two hours. Well, the fire pit's got not done yet. I got to put in more, more actual like spots to make it look like a real fire pit. But for now, it's it's there, it's placeholder. Try to make it exact, like exact as much as possible. This'll work. Okay, so this, this I can just pick up. I was gonna put this right in there. And the wood goes in there and that goes in there, sort of. And then we're gonna take this one with EHD again. And I spent a lot of time working on this yesterday. For what? There's a lot of things I need to do. Oh, you mean to make it look more like the flat part? Let me take a look at that idea. Let me put this in first, and then I'm going to pull it up and see if that will work. That's not a bad idea. Let me pull it open. Nord Hutch. Yes, and it's got the flat top.
It's perfect. Holy shit, you're right. Oh, God. Oh, I went to the wrong house. When my husband comes back with coffee, I might cancel this because I'm already being picked on. I was right. I am getting picked on by my friend, but not for what I expected. He hasn't even noticed how long this, this stream is yet. Thank you. Much appreciated. And then I go to the wrong house again, because I'm a moron. Please forgive me for my moronitude. Jesus. Well, now everything's out of here, I think. It's a bucket. Some books. I thought that my friend was going to pick on me for how, for something political I said. And in fact, I thought that's what he was mentioning, but he's actually talking about how annoyed, he's not annoyed with how long this is. I thought you were going to picking on me about my Pelosi position, but this is, this is crazy. And then this really pleases me. Yes, you're right, Dubat. I did need to place these anyway. Copy paste. Taste from inventory. Oh my god, it's like looking like it. It's exciting. I'm so excited. Aren't you guys excited? <laughs> I'm such a goof. H. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out, please. Please. Okay. I can't wait to show you guys just how accurate this one is, too. I spent so much time yesterday doing this. Oh, you are picking on me about Pelosi. Well, it'd be nice to know why, because I think I'm right. Wow, I made that way too high. Okay, I'm gonna have to lower those shelves. All right, so this picture goes with Hold on. Hold on. I'm getting there. Thank you. So that goes there. Uh, so that, that I'll move that over. Now, see, whoops, I agree with y'all, y'all, that, uh, that the Halalu thing, I think, would look better. The Halalu, um, cabinet. Why do I keep changing pictures? I don't mean to change pictures. But I'm concerned that it doesn't look naughty enough. My husband, when he saw me doing this, he said, oh my God, no. <laughs> no! <laughs> I was like, no. I am not, because I, I had to open up uh, Skyrim in order to, to get these screenshots that I took. And he was just like, I'm never going to see you again. That's it. But the truth is, is, is that for which, for which, which, oh, are you talking about for the shelves? 
There's plenty of shells I could do that are better. Uh, and I will use better ones. This is just a placeholder at this point. Um, it is not exact. Unfortunately, these are the Nord ones, but you are absolutely right that I could use better things. Um, it was just to get the idea of what it would look like, you know? Oops. But you're right, I do need better ones. I just tried to Everything's too chunky. You're right. The shelves need to go. I need to find something better right now. Um, but I would, yeah. I hate that these whole, these particular cups have no bottoms. But they have no bottoms. All right, so I need better shelves. Let's see which shelves I can do. Um, but we're coming along, folks. We're coming along. You're such an asshole. God, that's just rude. All right, I'll come to your Matisse and Is that your name in game? I never remember, yeah. This um, is a long stream because it's going to be a lot of building, like a lot of hard building. And I need to start making, I need to make hutches. <laughs> Unfortunately, they're bottomless in that they hold, don't hold anything. And the shelves are where? Inside or outer balconies? I would assume the shelves are inside. Aha! Shelves! Oh my goodness, this is, this is exactly what I needed to see. All right. It looks like, which one is it? I'm going to have to flip one of them over, but it looks like this one down here might be too long. This one. What's this one? Are you able to tell me? Oh! That looks like a Hlalu one, a short Hlalu. Floral, who's got the floral? Which one is that? I'm sure I have it. Dress shelf block, okay, thank you. 
these are these are so chunky and not a, I mean I want to use Nord in everything but this is so subtle that I'm not sure that anyone would notice that it is not Nord I'm hoping um, these things are an add-on so ignore that those knives those aren't fair I think this pot this pot up top here the blue one Looks just like uh, the Elsewhere Cerulean pot, but I could be wrong. Okay, dredge shelf block. I'm a Nord too. This is a Nord building this right now. Dredge shelf. That would be in a library, wouldn't it? Seriously, I don't have dress shelf. Oh, there it is. Derp. What am I missing? Obsidian. Okay, I can make one. <sighs> Story of my life. And then <coughs> I'm still struggling about the thing on the bottom. It doesn't seem like we have anything that's similar enough to those to that cabinet. Oh, I'm glad. This has been a lot of work. Um, I hadn't intended on building the house from scratch, but what happened was, was I was using um, Moon Mirth because it's exactly the same, you know, you walk in and it's straight ahead and that's all you see. <coughs> it's just a box. Everything else has you come in from the side and then you turn and then that's where the box is. It's like always a an upside down L shape and so it's really annoying um, let me make another one while I'm here dress shelf block craft all right and then I need the Nord hutch be kitchen or hearth. Okay. Let me go to the glint and put it in. Yeah, I mean, there's going to be a lot of things that I can tweak and, and maybe, you know, get. Oh, it's, um, what's my call it? Oblivion. Oblivion style. UI. God, I need my husband back. I'm dying of coffee-lessness. I love it. Uh, I got it off of Minion. So this is the way that it's furnished the, for the first time. Yeah, oh, sorry. Yeah, I'll, I'll go on to online. Just let me land. Okay. I'm online. Now, what I want to do is do these upside, no, they're right side up, that's proper. <sighs> Let me put this back away. Wait a minute. I think there are two different, there are two different pictures. The one I'm following here is not the same as the one that I took. So I'm going to do it my way. 
I'm not going to do it the way that this person says that it looks like. They probably modded it somehow. I'm not modding. It's going to look weird though. But this is the way that it shows in, the, in my picture. <laughs> Thanks. Shows it being like this, really. But you know what? While it looks like that, it looks kind of dumb, doesn't it? No, nope, I'm going to do it normal, I guess. Pot. Here is my pot. Here is my second pot? No. Oh, hello. Come on. 240. There. Nope. Fifty-three. So let's try that. Fifty-three. That's right. That's right. So that's making it flat. That's what I was thinking. I'm going to get the Halalu Cabinet Clerk. I think that one is the best one, and then we'll just flip it upside down. Thank you, though. I think that'll work. Little trick you can do. If you select something with Q, um, you can move it just it and not worry about um, selecting it or anything, because technically it's already selected. Right. So much easier to place stuff carefully with EHT. All right. Now I want to take the pots away. I guess, but I don't want them to notice. I really don't want them to notice that this is um, all right so we're gonna replace this so we'll put that away for now sure uh, if I could buy one from you I'd be happy to happy to buy all right, now we're gonna do this properly, if I can. Don't want it to look stupid. Dear God, why is surface drag being stupid when I don't even have it on? There. You know what, so much of me cooking, I mean, so much of me building is uh, me yelling at the screen. So I apologize for that. Thank you. I apologize for all of the yelling, but that is truly how I work sometimes, I guess. It, you know, it's just annoying because it's acting like it has surface drag on, but it doesn't have surface drag on. There. We'll get there. We'll get there. Slowly, but we'll get there. Hard work. And we're going to make this really tight together because I don't have a lot of space before the roof. But I think that's right. All right, lighting. Did I not just... Oh, derp. This may be too big a pot. It is too big a pot. I need a smaller pot. Honestly, the cerulean pot would look perfect, but it's too big, I think. Yay! 
Hello? <gasps> You're the best ever. Thank you. Don't know if you want your fancy Frenchie. Yes, but I will become. I will be almost done in a minute. I just have to. <sighs> yeah, I'll be out in a minute. Let me just get it. Yeah, I'll do it then. But I just want to get this to a certain place. Do I not have the elsewhere pot cerulean? I guess not. Um, so this I made, it was too big. Oh, uh, the, the, the one that only has the two, the only, the uh, two levels rather. So the Halalu cabinet clerk. Because I'm going to flip it upside down, I think. That is close. That's closer. The garden, Lalu Jar Garden. Let me try that. Yeah, I thought this should really, and it was really big. I don't think these are cooking things. I think these are, I have to make them in maybe enchanting. Thank you. Thank you so much, coffee time. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Craft. Let's try it out, shall we? Worst case scenario, I have an extra pot. Oh no. Thank you. All right, let's try it. Pottery. Oh, yeah, look, it fits. Nice call. Totally nice call. It just fits perfectly. I gotta fix that shelf too. It was like 53, I think. 53. Why did you disappear? You're 53. Zero, I don't get it. You look right, all right. This is pleasing. This is quite pleasing. Thank you. Yay, you're the best. Okay, we can do it, we can do it. I'm excited. So let's try, let's try this cabinet. Well, what I'm thinking is we could flip this one upside down, right? Maybe. Oh, thank God you people are paying attention. I am a dumbass. Oh, yeah, I was happy. It makes me happy. So I'm thinking of flipping this upside down so that it has the little, the little openings. I don't know if it's going to make a difference with a, actually the height's actually pretty good. Maybe I'll just, I don't know. Maybe it doesn't look good. I don't know. I haven't quite figured it out. <laughs> Need something else on top, like a shelf. I'll put another shelf on top and see if I can fix it that way. Why do you always want to grab the wrong thing? That could work. And then like, I'll get an, I'll make another one and then use the top. Yeah. Just flip it over it. That might work really well, actually.
Let me try that. I'm assuming that's a library. Yeah, I think it'll add a little handles if I do the if I do the second one. I hear my husband out there cleaning. I feel so bad. I told I told him we had to do the put the Christmas tree away. It's not put away yet. <laughs> uh, what is this under? Lalu. The empty slots up to get rid of the gold details. I kind of, I know the gold details don't work, but at the same time, like I kind of. Man, I have like nothing halalu. Why do I have like no halalu stuff? All right, I gotta call it. I gotta help my husband, but I will be here and working on it. So I will catch y'all tomorrow and we'll, we'll see what else we can do. So thank you. Okay, catch you later. Thanks for all the help. Adios.